Hey guys, what's going on? It's Andrew from AR Media. In tonight's video, I want to review Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom on 4K UHD Blu-ray. Now, I missed this one in theaters, so I was super pumped to get this in and give this a watch. So let's go over the movie quick. So I actually did enjoy this movie, but I wouldn't say I was disappointed as a big Jurassic Park and Jurassic World fan. Now, it did add some new things to the series that I did like, but I felt that the storyline overall was weak, and the new characters that they added didn't really develop, and I didn't find myself caring about them if they died or anything like that really happened and I think that is a problem now where this movie does shine though is is the cinematography I think this has the best cinematography probably of any Jurassic Park or Jurassic World movie I've seen and it adds in suspense and horror that's been missing from this franchise in a long time and that was definitely missing from Jurassic World the original one this has a nice aspect of suspense and horror added to it and some really cool dynamics so I definitely had a good time with it, but overall I was disappointed. I think they could have done a lot more with the storyline, a lot more with the characters, and just a lot more with the franchise overall. Now let's get to the video quality. So this was shot in a mixture of a 6.5 and 3.4K. This was digitally shot and this is a 2K digital intermediate upscale to 4K. And what that brings is a very nice increase in detail here. The detail is a very nice increase when it comes to the dinosaurs. You could see that instantly on the skin. You could see that instantly on their claws. Also on the landscape, you could see individual strains of grass. You could see the landscape as it gets destroyed, as you will see a lot in this movie. And there is great overhead shots as well, as well that provide a lot of detail. The depth here is also very good, providing separation from foreground and from the background, and also a 3D effect at times when a dinosaur is running at you or there's an explosion towards the camera. Now the black levels here are also nothing to complain about, deep and inky throughout, and a nice improvement over the Blu-ray. Now let's get to the Dolby Vision and HDR. So this is a pretty bright and vivid movie. Most of it takes place in the daytime, at least the first two-thirds uh, two of it takes place in the daytime, and you get bright and vivid colors, a lot more punch to the colors, a lot more nuances to the colors. Some specific scenes is one with lava, where lava is flowing down a mountain. Within that lava, you can tell a lot more nuances to the color, a lot more detail to the color, and it pops off the screen a lot more than the Blu-ray version. Specifically, the Dolby Vision version really shines in scenes like that. Some of those scenes are really demo-worthy for a 2K upscale and demo-worthy when it comes to Dolby Vision. Now let's get to the audio mix. This has a DTS-X mix and I have nothing to complain about here. Overheads were utilized great. This had a nice dynamic mix. The soundtrack was good, although the score I thought was a bit obscene at times, just like way too epic of music, but that's not at all a knock on the sound mix, but that's more just the sound score on their end. But overall, the DTS-X was a great mix, used great overheads, and a very dynamic with great use of surrounds as well. So anyway guys, this is a tough one for me to rate because as a movie itself, I wouldn't rate this one a day one pickup. But for the picture quality and for the audio quality, I would say this is a day one pickup if you're a fan of the franchise. But if you've already seen the movie in theaters and you're a fan of the franchise, I'd say maybe wait for a sale on this one. I just don't think the story was there. I don't think the rewatchability is there as much as the other ones. But that's up for you to decide. So let me know down below in the comments what you thought of the movie. Let me know what you thought of the picture quality. And I'll see you guys in the next one.